Well, now to the video that may play a huge role in the governor's race. Governor Hickenlooper apologizing to county sheriffs for not talking to them before signing the controversial gun laws. We asked the governor's office last week about that apology. His spokesperson told us we had it all wrong. Tonight, KRDI News Channel 13's Emily Allen uncovered new video showing the governor apologizing. James and Heather, the governor's spokesperson, Eric Brown, said in an email last week that his staffers recorded the speech, but now their files won't play. Then an organization called Revealing Politics posted this video on YouTube. It shows Hickenlooper addressed the sheriffs. I apologize. I don't think we did a good job on, on any of that stuff. And, and uh, we've worked very hard since then to... Uh, open those doors of communication. Governor John Hickenlooper faces his toughest critics and admits the fight over the gun bills could have gone better. One sheriff asks him why he didn't meet with them before signing the bills into law. I certainly could have done a better job. And I think that the, I didn't, this is, I'm not defending this, there's no, I didn't find out that the sheriffs were trying to talk to me until a week afterwards. He says he didn't know the limit on high capacity magazines would be so divisive. A lot of people, if they'd known how much promotion was going to come out of the high capacity magazines, probably would have uh, looked for something different or a different approach. Uh, one of my staff made a commitment that, that we would sign it if it got passed. To be honest, no one in our office thought we would get, we'd, we'd get through the legislature. Last week, the Montezuma County Sheriff posted on Facebook. Governor Hickenlooper admitted to supporting the gun laws without researching them. Eric Brown with the governor's office says the governor and his staff researched the issue extensively. But in this video, Hickenlooper says he saw the research after the bills were signed. So we were forming legislation without basic facts, which I think is a, a bad idea in every case. Uh, it took almost a month to get the facts. By that time, I pissed you guys off. I. You know, they, they already passed legislation. Hickenlooper went on to say when the facts did come in, it showed communities were safer thanks to the gun laws. We have contacted the governor's office for a response. Spokesperson Eric Brown said tonight that his comments that he made on Friday still stand. In the newsplex, Emily Allen Cardio, News Channel 13. Thanks, Emily.